Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to Quadrants. So last time, what happened was, our friends got eaten by some gigantic monster from what it sounds like. And some douche brain decided to say on the speakerphone to that he's gonna lock down the entire area and that we, we would die, basically, inside the compound. So yeah, things are looking up for John, and what the devs actually told me that they added a day one patch where, um... They didn't tell me that, but, uh, they... Okay? Oh. Did you open that for me? Thank you! I, uh, as I was saying, uh, devs actually did a day one patch where John can actually sprint for a little bit more now before he starts fogging everywhere. As you can see, yeah, he can sprint more, yay! John actually gave up smoking and, you know, started jogging a little bit more and... Now he can actually sprint for a little bit more. So that's actually a great, great addition to the game. It, it will make things a lot more better. Like running away from stuff, definitely. And let's go... Uh, well, this is a dead end. Huh, okay. Well, that was nice of the monster to just open a vent of nowhere. Cool, cool. Alright. Well, what's in that one? Should I... Am I just wasting my time with these vents? I probably am, but uh, yeah, okay. Uh, okay, let, where to go? I don't think I want to go to that locker room. Yet. I don't, I, I don't know, I'm not sure if it's a little bit dark. It doesn't seem like it right now, but it might be when I upload it to YouTube. If that's the case, please let me know. Uh, key card required, okay. So yeah, that's the situation we're in. Our friends are dead. Some douche brain, ass nozzle, locked us in here, in the entire compound. And it's safe to say that we're gonna get eaten and pooped out by monsters. And whatever that thing was, it sounded big, so I don't think my little flashlight... Where's my flashlight? My flashlight is gone! Wait, not this flashlight, but the flashlight that I was carrying to use as a weapon, it's gone! No! Why is, why is it gone? No. Uh, it's... I, I, it, it's not here! I'm, I'm pressing everything. It's not here. Okay, well that sucks! Now we don't have a weapon anymore. Uh, oh man, that is that, that puts things in perspective of how we're gonna get screwed so badly. I, I don't have a weapon. This is bad, and I'm just looping. All, is that fire right here? Where is it at? What is all this thing? Huh. Can I open these now? Okay. Huh. I'm not sure where to go. So again, it's not like he's still Usain Bolt or anything like that, but, you know, he, he, he's better. He's better at it. God damn. Mouse, you showed me the way once, show me the way again. And it, it is not here. The door looks like it be a century security. Isn't this, I, this is the door that I came out from, okay. And then, I... Did I go in here? I, I think I did, yeah. I went to the locker room. Something roared in this place and I backed out of it like a... ...sane person. There's a vent over there. Should I go into it? Is it it's a dead end, I think. Is it? Is there... No, yep, yeah, it's a dead end. And... What is that? Why is that flashing? I'm guessing it's alien blood. It's highly radioactive, probably. <laughs> but yeah. Um, let's see. Oh! What? You don't like electrical cleaner? Well, I, I mean, it doesn't make for a good drink, I agree, but, you know, that's not- that's no reason to, like, just throw it out of there, man. Uh... Okay. Oh, you, you opened this for me. Thank you. I... Why am I going into the vent that the alien just crawled into? 
Uh, yeah, come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know what I did that either. Can I jump over this? Come on, you can do it. Uh, crouch jump, come on. Uh, no. Okay, doesn't work like that. Cool, let's go into the staircase that I opened. But yeah, so far for an indie game, I'm really liking this game. It has, it has some legit terrifying moments. So far, nothing has jumped at us yet. But I'm sure that will change very soon, like now in this very dark file cabinet room. I, I, I'm really, really not liking this room. It's setting me up for something. It's called like crawl into the goddamn file cabinets and avoid the patrolling monster type of deal. Fuse! And I haven't really found that much of a use for this many fuses yet. The only time I used that fuse was um, to go through one door, and it used like only four fuses. Ooh, film. What is it going to show me, film? Let's see. Show me. Show me your secrets. The moon. Hi, moon. Are you gonna? Well, there's something over there. Is that a ship or rocket or I don't know. I can't see it. I can't see very well through this uh, film. Ooh, what is this? Sam Thomas, Sector 3. Audio log has been recorded on July 22nd, 1979. Research laboratories have been sterilized. Central air has been temporarily shut down in order to block and reroute air back through other facility sectors. Let the record show a wealth of moon rocks have been received and will be examined thoroughly at a later time. Oh, okay. Cool to know. Thank you. Oh, cool! I got another flashlight! Good! I lost it before, but I got it back! Yes! I can be an usher again! Mo a movie theater usher. What is this? Oh, the keycard! Cool. All oh, right, that door at the very end. I should go through that. And a fire extinguisher! Oh, game! You know me so well. I just want to smash things. Right? And I think J John doesn't swing like a five-year-old anymore. This is good. This is good. Things are looking up, guys. Things are finally looking up. John can sprint. And he can also swing better. This is so cool. Thank you. I was going to say thank you very much. Thank you very much, devs, for listening to, you know, Let's Players. But now I think we have another problem. And involving monsters. Hello. I know you don't you don't like the electrical cleaners, but you know that's no reason to go all pissy about it. I mean, it's not for drinking; it's for cleaning. Hey, monster, you there? You gelatin. Was that door open? Okay, that door wasn't open. I think. I think. I. Whoa, 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 what, 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 close the door, close the door, you idiot, it's called, get the hell out of there, okay, okay, uh, ooh, 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 hey, what's going on, okay, that sounds like it's in the room somewhere, I, I'm not here, I'm not here, I'm under the stairs, I'm gonna hide like a five-year-old under the stairs, I, 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 is he still here? I got a flashlight that I will use to swing into your face and a fire extinguisher too. Come on, I'm ready. I'm ready to be a movie theater usher or a fireman. I will seriously security guard your ass with this flashlight. Come on, come at me. Well, whatever that thing is, it sounds pretty big. I don't think the flashlight or the fire extinguisher is gonna phase it too much. I... Is it, is it here? Is it here? Can I go through this door? I can't. Can I jump over this thing? I can't. Okay. Oh, man. And I'm back here, obviously, because... So 
<laughs> Something inside me told me not to go that way. You know. Just a hunch. Based on the noises alone. Based on the boxes being thrown apart. And the fact that thing just sounded really pissed off. And the fact that I only have a flashlight to defend myself with. Well, okay, let's not forget the fire extinguisher, but... Still, that's, that doesn't exactly make for a best defense against these ass bags. Okay, where was the door that I was... Uh, ah, flashlight, turn off. Where was the keycard door? Was it... It was somewhere around here, I know. Was it across that one, or... Was it right here? Oh, it was right here. Okay. Okay, we're out of here. We are out of here. Oh! Saving! Yes! Oh, let's close the door. I don't like the sound of that. Should I go down or go up? Hold on. I'm gonna go down first. Down is always the worst option when you're playing a horror game. So let's check out the bad option first. And I'm sure I'm gonna die. Because the alien is probably somewhere down here. Can I take anything from here? No. Boxes! Do you have anything for me? Okay, I can't go this way. Cool. Alright, time to go up. Time to go up. Come on, John. You can do this. I believe in you. I have the tiger, baby. Come on. You can do this. Okay, you can't. Sorry. That sucks. You don't have the eye of the tiger anymore, John. Uh... Hello? I don't think I should be going up. Going up is bad too, apparently. Can I open this? No. But I don't want to go up. I don't want to go through that door. It sounds like something is behind that door. Uh. Oh, cool. Uh, I don't know. Well, let's uh, follow the bl blood trail. I was going to say. But maybe not. Maybe we should go the other way. Opposite of the blood trail. Door open. I need some, like, rooms to go into. The alarm stopped. Why did the alarm stop? Why did the alarm stop? I don't like the fact that the alarm stopped just suddenly like that. Oh, cool. We get to follow the blood trail where I'm sure... There is absolutely nothing. It's just some guy that just fell and splattered this brain all over the, you know, walls. Oh. Oh. I don't really want to go into that vent. Please don't tell me that's what you want me to do, game. Huh. Can I? Oh, okay. Well, we have to go to, into the feeding ground of the monster, and I'm sure he's gonna just gonna love that. I'm really expecting something to jump up here. Hello? Monster? Are you here? I'm gonna go the opposite way, maybe, hopefully. That'll... Uh, okay, that leads to a dead end. Obviously not the best idea. Oh... Look at the little mess you made. Okay, if I pick up that fuse... What's gonna happen? It, it, it looks like it's... Leading to something. Cause I have... Enough fuses. I don't wanna pick up this fuse and like... Summon something. And why can't I pick up this fuse? So, was that it? I... I don't know where to go though. I don't know where to use these use these fuses. I haven't seen any door with a fuse. Have I? Or M Mr. Monster, can you open a door for me like that one over there? Or 
you know, one of these doors. Preferably without eating me. I'm hoping. Uh, yeah, I don't... Oh. Why didn't I try this door, right? I thought I tried every door, but apparently not. I'm too stupid to, like, try everything. Uh, close the door. Close, close the door. Yeah, please. I don't want anything... Ooh. Well, this is a pretty big room, too, so... I don't think closing the door will do anything. Drawers are locked. Okay, well... Obviously, you want to keep everything secure. Duh. Uh, let's see. What is this? Okay, I'm gonna read this. Please don't sneak up behind me. It should... Oh, was well, top secret. Specimen 13A, Quadrant 3 testing, and research result log. It should also be noted that upon further testing, the subject seems to possess certain telekinetic abilities. In an aggression study, several rats were killed from hard matter impacts inflicted as a subject, strapped in static position, flung various objects placed around the perimeter of the chamber towards the rats. We'll now proceed with genetic testing on all other subjects or anomalies regarding this finding. Okay! I don't know what to say to that, because he has telekinetic abilities. So my flashlight and my fire extinguisher has just become completely and utterly useless against this thing. Cool. That's nice. Quadrant 3. Analysis and test results. New rock specimen have been received as of yesterday, June 18, 1979. Over the course of 24 hours, selected samples have shown an increase in size approximately 15% when exposed to terrestrial air. One specimen in particular appears to have various magnetic attributes, somehow pulling objects closer even if the objects themselves contain no known magnetic char characteristics. Well, that's nice. I have no idea uh, what that was about, but cool. Cool story. Add a wizard next time. It, it could always use one. Uh, get the flashlight out, even though, you know, that's probably gonna do absolutely nothing. And I'm, I'm probably... like, 90% certain there are more other monsters here. Rather than just this, uh, assweed with telekinetic abilities. Uh, yeah. Can I open this? Is there anything in this place? Oh, notes. More notes. To William Hill. I've gotten word from researchers researchers in Quadrant 3. The specimens are showing signs of life, movement, awareness, even partial understanding. Their learning will what we have found, what humanity has found will change the way we view the universe forever. Such a huge stride for humankind was inevitable. We've been looking for so long. Here's what we've been searching for. The first signs of intelligent extraterrestrial life. Yeah, I'm sure that's not gonna bite you in the ass in any shape or form whatsoever. Yeah, yeah. Extraterrestrial life, telekinetic abilities. Yeah, let's, you know, keep it locked up here and unleash it against the world when it escapes. Cool. That's... That's very smart. You know, maybe you should have at least like 100 dudes machine guns posted in this research facility just in case that thing tries to get out. And, you know, a tank would have hurt either. And maybe an Apache helicopter, you know. Just to blow shit up. In case, you know, flashlights don't work. In case flashlights doesn't work against this thing. And it sounds like it's not gonna. Another fuse. Cool. And... Oh, yeah. Let's get out of here. Well, somebody made a mess of this place. Come on, come on. I, I'm seriously, like, genuinely... <laughs> uh, vent! Vent! I was gonna say, uh, I was genuinely curious if there was a monster in the room with me, in that locker room scene. Or was it just, like, a scare to, you know, Scared the ever-living shit out of me. I don't know, maybe there might have been, and we actually might have avoided it, if there really was. If, like, if, like, a moron, I proceeded further, I might have encountered it. Who knows? And I'm thinking maybe that, that was the case. 
and that me running away actually set it off somewhere else. Hopefully. I think. But yeah. Ouch. Something hit the wall hard here. Hmm. I don't like this hallway. This hallway says chase scene. And yeah, I can I can read your hallway like like a book. I know something's gonna pop out from somewhere. And I'm gonna have to run or fight. Oh man, can this hallway please end? Okay, there we go. Fuse. How many fuses do I have, I wonder? Hold on. Can I actually check it out? Collectibles. F 17 fuses, jeez. I wonder what I'm actually... Do I have that many doors to open, really? I really wonder this. Flashlight. You are my only protector. And the fire extinguisher too. You guys are my only friends in this place. My two human friends are dead. But you guys... Oh, okay, let's not go in there yet because I can just smell something is gonna go wrong in there. Can I... Let's check this place out. Okay, can't open it. Can't, can't open this one either. This? It, it shows me open the close... I, I want to open the close end door. Oh, there's like rocks in front of it, so that's... But not in front of this one, is there? Uh, okay. Well, I can't open it. Or close it. So... I'm assuming we have to not be there. Uh, I don't want to go into the library of death. Not just yet. Open. Nope. Open. Nope. Open. Nope. Oh, another fuse. Open. Nope. I feel like Silent Hill, you know, all these doors that are like locked it can't be opened. Okay, John. Shh. Calm down. Oh man. Hello, Phil. I don't want to be here. I don't. This place says sneak around the big ass monster that you will not be able to kill. That's what this place says right now to me. Oh man. Of course, the fact that it didn't save kinda actually makes me. uh. relaxes me. Because I don't think there might be a monster coming. If it didn't save. If it saved, then I would have been, yeah. I would have been like, yeah, it's preparing for a monster. But it didn't, so I'm kinda hopeful on that regard. Oh man. Oh man. What, what are these, uh, films? Show me. Oh, I'm guessing that's our little telekinetic alien. Or what's inside of him. What is this? The moon again. What is that? A spider? Oh, man, I don't, I don't like, I don't, I don't like giant spiders. I don't like, I, I really don't like giant moon spiders. Restore power to the elevators. Why would I... Oh, music, what are you doing? Why are you being... What is that sound? Is that... I, I think you guys are hearing what I'm hearing. The music is picking up to a very... Very tense... Music. It sounds like a gigantic trombone or... Something is playing. I, I really, really don't like the fact that the music changed. I feel like Jaws is after me, man. What? What? Why are you. Oh! Camera. Why are you beeping at me? Are you like Monstrum? Are cameras against me too in this game? Can I smash them? I wonder if they actually like lead the monster here. Lift. I'm guessing, yeah. Okay, these are the elevators that I'm supposed to restore power to. What 
Stop looking at me, camera. Oh, man. I don't... I want to get out of here. <laughs> I don't... I, screw the elevators. I want to... I just want to jump out of this facility. Stay in the vents forever, John. Well, I mean, they go into the vents too, so I'm guessing that's not a good idea. But the music... The music has picked up, and it's really making me tense, man. It's... It's really making me tense. What? Why did that thing shake? I... Oh, cool. Ripped apart door. Hi. Alright. Hopefully it's safe soon, because I'm running out of time. And... We haven't found any monsters yet. Thankfully, I'm kind of thankful that we haven't, actually. But the tension has been there, man. It's really tense. And I don't know if we, like, avoided any monsters or we just... They're not triggered yet. I like to think that I avoided some. I, I like to think that I'm actually a little bit, you know... Skilled in playing this. Whatever, whatever skill that may be. I don't know. Or maybe I'm just, like... Not. And extremely lucky. I, I don't know, man. But... I'm thinking we might have our first monster encounter pretty soon. Based on the music alone. Come on. Oh, another fuse. I still... I have like 19 fuses now, don't I? Almost 20. I wonder if I'll ever get to... Um, Okay, here's a question game. How do I restore the power to the elevators? I'm, I'm assuming I'm gonna, it has something to do with these fuses. I don't like that door. I don't know why, I just don't... I, I can't open it. Wait, where am I supposed to go then? H haven't I been to most of the places? Okay, John, calm down. I don't think I've been here. I haven't been in there either. Or have I? No. It's another office that is extremely gone to shit. I wish I would save more often, and, and like sometimes I find myself wandering around, and it obviously wastes some time. But um, yeah, I wish I wish you had the option to at least save a bit more often, huh? Or at least when you exit the game. Like I can understand you know you don't want to have the player. Um, Save every second. That kind of takes away from the horror aspect of it. But maybe when oh, they exit the game completely, maybe it does. I I I just haven't seen it. Ooh. All right. This was the hallway of doom. Hang on. Uh. Let me go here. I'm not here. God. Okay. Yeah. My pathfinding ability really sucks. Yeah, it was here. Oh yeah, been here. God damn it. Okay. Oh yeah, let's go into the cafeteria or of doom. Oh. Yeah. This is not gonna go very... Very well. As I was saying. I wonder if these monsters can see the light. Uh, should I turn my flashlight off if I... Encounter some... This... There's something there. I don't particularly want to go to it. Holy shit. Yeah, this entire room says chase scene. Or sneak scene. Or something. It spells doom. And death. And destruction. And getting your face eaten off. By some alien that can apparently use telekinesis. Close the doors. Close the doors and lock them tight, man, because I know once I turn on the power to the elevators, some shit is gonna come here. Really? You don't want to close the doors, John? You really think that's a good idea, not to close the doors? Oh, saving. Okay, guys, I'm gonna stop here because I'm really out of time. Yeah, wow. Uh, yeah. So far, really, tension's building up a lot, and I love it. And I'm sure once I restore the power to the elevator that I see over there, like... 
the fuse box over here. Once I do that, I'm sure shit is gonna go down. I I'm definitely sure of it. So thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!